What's up guys, GT Game here and welcome back to uh, Transport Fever, god god I forgot the name of the series, UK, holy crap. Yeah, you know when you haven't played a game for like a week or two and you play loads of other games and then you forget everything about your game? Yeah, I'm currently in that state of mind, so you'll have to excuse me, there's so much to do, like god damn. A uh, lot of oil there, a lot of oil, how much oil? Yeah, 500, that's not great. Uh, there is so much to do. Yeah. In other news, it is snowing really heavy outside my house. There's like an inch of snow and it's only been snowing for an hour. Which, if you're in Canada, you're like, yeah, that's nothing. But yeah, I would take my moose out for a walk and that. But over here in uh, Wales, that's pretty deep unless you live on a mountain. Which most Welsh people do, but just ignore that. Uh, I don't even know where to start. You know when you're in one of those moves, it's like when you're tied in your bedroom, you're just like, where on earth do I start? <clears throat> yep, yeah, that's me right now. That is 100% me. Where do we start? I guess we probably should start taking care of the oil. We got 7 million, so... I don't know, maybe boost these trains up a little bit? Would that be... What's this flashing alert? Oh, that's... I wish they would go away. Is there a way to make them go away? No, no pinpoints them. God damn. Well, that didn't work. That's like 600 there now. That is 700. It's coming up on 7. Yep, there's 700. Yeah, we we badly need to do something about this. Okay, oil cars. Let's add how much we got? 8 million. So let's try adding another 4 to each train. 1, 2, 3, 4. Replace now. How much is that going to cost? 8.25. We're almost there. Come on, game. You can give us the extra 200,000. Uh, yeah, there it is. Nailed it. So they're going to upgrade. That might help a little bit. Because what the issue is now is the longer trains are going to transfer all the oil down here. It's going to be turned into fuel. So we're going to have a backup of fuel down here. Actually, no, because the trains take it back. Uh, yeah. Oil goes there, fuel goes there, fuel goes to London. Yeah, that's right. So, okay, this will at least alleviate some of the, f the oil here, like the 800 oil. Yeah. So, when fuel becomes an issue, we'll bump up the other trains. But for now, let's just see how that does it. Because you don't want to overdo it, you want to just fine-tune it. So, uh, what else can we do? Ireland looks fine. Scotland. Scotland looks fine. How are the planes doing? That's probably a good idea. We should probably check out finances. Something's losing a lot of money. Norwich Fuel. What are you? Where are you? You are there. Why are you losing money? Where are you? There. So the train is running. Why are you losing money? Uh one train. Are you going to pick anything up? Carry seven. That's loud. This shouldn't be losing that much money. Definitely not that much. We might have to cut that down a little bit. So let's see. So it drops off seven. Let's see what it gets on the return trip. There's no build-up, so that's not the issue. Ah, uh, no, I'm going to give that a bit of time. It could just be that it hasn't had enough time to sink in yet. That's what I'm hoping, at least. We got two lines without any vehicles. Norwich. That! There, that is the issue. Oh, God. Ah! I didn't put any vehicles on the Norwich lines. Uh, let's put MANs on there. One, two, three, four, five. Set line. Uh, Norwich fuel. Yep. Yeah. Right, that should now make some money. That will boost the profits on that line, hopefully. Because if we go up to Norwich and click the station, that is its catchment. And if we go on here, uh, that one, the orange is its target. So, yeah, it's got nothing. It's delivering to those four. That's why it's so bad. Right, that is that problem solved. Right, what other problems are there? I do want to build something in this episode, but problem solving is also important. The, the plane lines are just... Like, really? 
Uh, oh well. I did remember, I just it just occurred to me what I said we was going to do in this episode. And I'm actually quite excited for it. I think this is going to be awesome. Um, if you remember, we said that here's the ore mine, here's the construction materials plant. So we could get boats to take ore to be refined into construction materials. Then bring them back. And then somehow get them to London, to there, to be distributed. So this is basically our distribution centre. Let's, let's try this, let's see how this works. So we want boats. Uh, freight. So let's flip you round. Uh, ooh. That'll do. That will do. And then a little bit of a road. And there. That is the best we can do with the road. Not particularly nice, but sometimes you just have to make do with what you got. If we smooth out, it won't be as bad, I think. Yeah, that's not the worst thing in the world. I've seen worse. Uh, ooh, that might be an issue. Is it in range? Yeah, just. That's fine. I'm, I'll, I'm fine with that. Right, and now somewhere over here. Uh, this is where it gets tricky. We might have to put a, some kind of truck line in. Uh, what's that? Is that an iron ore mine? Huh. This can't use iron ore though, can it? It uses slag and... Nah, that's not particularly good then. Okay, so we want another dock. Uh, other way around this time. That'll do. That's actually not that bad. And before I forget, because you know what my brain's like, just a simple road like that should be enough. Right, so it could take all there. Now we need to bring it back to there. And uh, I guess, I guess a train line, uh, not a passenger line. Uh, let's go for that one, why not? Two platforms, 120 plus 200 high speed. Tenery, sensory connection, no curvature. Let's see how this fits in. Probably not. Wow, that actually would go in like that. But can it connect to the road? No. Uh, you know what? I'm fine with that. And then. Ba -ba 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 -ba. What do I want? On that one. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You know you want to. Eek. No. God damn it. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> this is the most jank road ever. If I can actually get this to work, I'm going to wet myself. No, not at all. Not happening. Come on, autosave complete. Uh, at least we almost managed it. That's all that really matters. Okay, let's put it back in. But let's learn from our own mistakes and put it over here. And uh, now let's see if the road fits. Yeah, see? That's what you need. A little bit of in ingenuity and uh, persistence and eventually luck will do it for you. Yeah, uh, that's good enough. Okay, we got a freight, uh, freight line station line station thing in there. And it's going over here. Um, damn, that's got to cross a lot of lines. I could get a line under there. Easy. In fact, this road is pretty useless. I don't know why that's there. If you get rid of that road, it'll help. Yeah. That. And then... So it goes under there. Okay, I think I can make this work. I'm pretty sure I can make this work. Right, so platform. I'm going to use this one here. Actually, let's just check the lines real quick. Yeah, we could reuse that line. I don't see why not. So it goes over there. Yeah, that's not actually the right direction though, is it? Um, hmm. <laughs> you always have to think things like this through carefully. Otherwise you just throw it in and everything bad happens. Okay, let's go for a perfectly flat line so it fits. And I put that in this slow speed track because why not? God damn. I don't know if it's obvious, but I'm not on my A game today. I've had a lot of 
bad luck today. I bought a car yesterday, by board I mean my friend gave it to me for free. I had it MOT'd and it failed, just straight up failed. So I went to take it to my uncle's today to fix it and it wouldn't start. And it's snowing so I couldn't push start it or bump start it or anything. So yeah, not the best day ever, but I'm resilient. I'll get through this, just playing some games to take my mind off it because it did annoy me quite a lot. I want to bring this out relatively straight and flat. It'll just make it easier to um, put the crosses in and whatever. So this is the bridge I just put in. It's pretty nice. I like it. You've got room for boats to go under should we need to. I doubt it. We're not going to have a harbour there. But we got bridge over the road and which side are the tracks on? So that side. Uh, what would be smart then? I think the best way to do this would be to double track this. So let's take it out to there. And then let's take this one. Can we make it all the way? That is the question. Ah, oh, we can, but it won't work. God. Ah. Really? Really? I'm going to put this double track bit in. And then... Ah, oh, really? Okay, if we bring this out... Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. If we bring this bit out straight like that. And then... Yes! And connect that to there like that. And we want a decent bridge. Um, let's go for that one. Right, this should work now, hopefully. Stick that over to there. Is that connected? Yes, it is. Perfect. Right, how are we going to... I think I might have to redo this bridge, which is not something I was hoping to do. Um, yeah, I think we do. Okay. Damn. Let's put this side in first. And then... Um... I'm literally winging this as I go along. So if we put that in like that, and that one, and boom. That's not bad. That's pretty good, actually. I like that. Right, double track this. Uh, where's the edge of the track? There it is. All the way. Oh my god, we're actually out of money. And I've just noticed another problem. <laughs> uh... Okay, let's try this. Yeah, I've changed my keyboard, I got a new keyboard, and the layout is different, so the button I was using to play is in a different place on this keyboard. I genuinely thought I lost it for a second then. But this is gonna cost five million, this bridge. Like, really? Really? Five million? Yeah, I suppose it is a big bridge. Like, look at that, and it's a ton. Okay, that's kind of fair then. And boom. That is in. So it goes from there, breaks off there, that's like a nice little Y junction, level crossing, under there, over the tunnel, and then across into there. That is peachy. So that is going to take construction materials to London. And we've got, is that in range? I think I said that was in range. So if I click that, yeah, that's in range. So the rocks go to the harbour, the boats take it to there. We need to set up a truck line, because I doubt that's in reach. No, it's not. And then it brings back construction materials, and the construction materials go to London. That is perfect. That's exactly what I want. So let's stick a truck depot in somewhere by here. Uh, road, freight. Uh, yeah, let's just use this little one. No need to be extravagant with this. So if I stick that there... And another one. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, like that. Yeah, that's fine. I do want a depot as well, so if I put a depot, I'm losing my mind. As I said, it's been a while since I played this game, so I'm allowed to be a little bit slow there. Right, so let's put the lines in. We need, I believe it's three lines. I've lost where I am there. One, two, three. Line one. You are going to be from there to there and back. Yep, that's perfect. So this is going to be... Uh, 
S F. Yeah, ship freight. Uh, Irish con mats. Irish construction materials, and I want that a darker blue because it's a boat line. Right, line two. You are integral for this to work, so you're going to go from there to there to there to there. Help split traffic if you do it twice. You are going to be RF. Is this Limerick? I believe this is. Let's call it Dublin. Dublin con mat. And you, what colour should you be? Ireland, Ireland, it gotta be green. That was the worst accent ever in the history of accents ever. And then the, finally, the train line. The one we're all looking forward to. That goes from there to there. And it should be set. Uh, no, it's not separate because we haven't put the um, signals in. That's fine, we can do that now. And this is gonna be TF. Welsh con mats. Boom! And what colour should we have this once the save finishes? Orange! Right, I'm going to go around, put the signals in, and I will bring you right back. Right, that's the signals in and sorted. Please tell me that separated the lines. Yeah, kind of. Uh, ba -ba. They're all orange, that might be. Okay, let's change you to... Uh, let's go for a slightly... That's the most horrible colour ever. Okay, let's go for... No, that's also horrible. Okay, let's... Uh, red. Screw it. Red. Right, and also what I want to do... Terminals and both of you in the same one. I don't think so. So you can go to... Four? Is it Terminal Four? I think. I have no idea. No, that I'm pretty sure that broke the line, actually. Uh, what... Terminal is that then? One, two, three. That's terminal four. It's gotta be. Okay, let's unlock that and see what it does. Right, so it goes. I am so confused right now. That's one, two, three, four. Why will it not go to four? Let's bring the lines up. Right. So they both go in the same one. You go to four. Right, it works. I have no idea what that was about. Right. That is done, I believe. Um, oh my god, we have 18 million to play with. That was... I was not expecting that. Where can we put a depot? I want it somewhere... Eh, um, can't use that one. Okay, let's just stick it in by here somewhere. That's what she said. Runs alongside a bit. And then let's stick a depot on the end. Like, flip, flip. There. Right. We're buying trains first before we run out of money. That's just what I'm doing. Uh... Let's go for the class 86. How much are they? 7 million? Yeah, that's quite expensive. How much was a 37? 3. Uh, actually, yeah, let's go for class 37. This is carrying construction materials. That's state cars. Yep. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And let's double up on them. Stick. Uh, Irish mainline? No. TF Welsh Conmats. So that will go on there like that. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I gotta put the harbour in Bristol. It's gonna be Bristol Harbour. That worked out fine. Right, depot. I probably should have planned this episode a little bit better, I'm not gonna lie. Uh yeah. Bristol Harbour is there, so we want by ships. Uh, the biggest one that can carry construction materials is the the Axalt. How much are they? One million. We got. We haven't got enough. Uh, okay. Problem. Big problem. Have we got any loan? No. Uh, um, and it's the end of the month as well, so we can't really play it on to get money. Uh, what's that carry? Oil, passengers, passengers. 
Axe Help is their only option. Uh, okay, what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna sell one of these trains. I shouldn't... I <laughs> We need two, but realistically that's not gonna happen. So if I... Uh, you... Go to the depot and be sold. And if I play pause, I think I just got that. Yes, I did. Where there's a well, there's a way. Right, ships. It's better to have it work than just waste money because only a bit of it works. That's my logic. Right, let's have... Th three boats too much? You know what, I think three boats will be too much for now. So you, I'm going to sell. You two, I'm going to put on Irish con mats, if you load. Go on, behave. Right, and now we can deal with the trucks and stuff. So we need mans, one, two, three, four, four. Let's just keep clicking. That's my logic. There. Set you all on, 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 on. Where are you? RF. Dublin con mat, isn't it? I, I think so. I hope so. Please be, <laughs> please. I'm too tired for this not to be right. And set you on, this is going to be bright and fuel. Right, so we put eight more vehicles on both of those lines. That should help with the distribution. We got a train running, we got the boats running. Let's have a look at these boats. We haven't had a look at them yet. Ship two. Look at that. That is so good. That is going to be my thumbnail right there. Let's zoom in a bit. The Axel. Okay, that was weird. Pressed the wrong button there, I think. That is peachy. So this should... Has it picked up the... Yes, it's picked up the line. It's got production. You carrying anything? 20. Oh, this is going to work. I am so happy. Right, so overview. We've got fuel going in there. We have construction materials. Are going to be going in there soon. Uh, we need... What's the other things we need? Uh, ba -ba -ba, um, food. We need food. Uh, food was the really complicated one where most of it's in Ireland. I mean, we could utilise the boat lines. That is a lot of boat... Uh, boats? That's a lot of trucks. God damn. Anything to do with food in this country. Right, there's a plant up there. There's a farm up there, so... Farm to there. I mean, that's just a train line, we could do that. Um... Ha. Huh. How are we gonna do this? I really should plan these episodes out a bit more, but... I'm thinking something cool would be to utilise the boats and the trains, but I don't know, that'd make the train lines and all a bit busy, wouldn't it? The only other option would be to have a train which picks up corn, takes it to be processed, brings it down. I mean, it's doable. It's definitely doable. Should we do that? What do you guys think? Leave me a comment below. Let me know. Let me know what you think. Good, because I'm going to do it anyway. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I'm going to do it. How am I going to do this? Oh, God. Uh, right. Let's use... Hmm. Okay, let's just bring a straight piece of track out. Flat. And stick that like that. Would a bridge or a tunnel be better there? Um, I only use a top speed of, of 100, so 101, that's fine.
and this is going to be TF. Uh, go what? Th there's no specific area I can name this. Just like it goes from Scotland to Southern England to ah, screw it. GB Great Britain food. That's pretty much the best I can come up with. Names I'm not very original. But that is officially the longest line I've put in on this map. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm right in saying that. Yeah, because the West Coast mainland goes at Liverpool, and then we've got a different one going at... Yeah, that is... I'm pretty sure that's the longest line I've put on this map. It goes literally zigzags across the country. I do love this little bridge with a tunnel there, though. That... Let me just turn the icons off so you can appreciate that. Tell me that don't look good. Like, tell me. I dare you. That is awesome. That looks cool as... I'm not going to finish that sentence, but that looks cool. Right. I want a depot. Where on earth am I going to put the depot? Um... Huh. Okay. It's going by here, I guess. So, no, not. Not. Try air signals. That, like that. And that, like, no, what the hell was that? That, like that. And just a little bit like that. And I want the, 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 the depot. Uh, I, I do love that depot there, mind. I don't know why I like that one so much, I just do. Right, what are we going to put on here? We've already got distribution at the other end sorted, so all we need to buy is trains. So let's do it. Uh... I really want to use these class 86s. They look really good. Um, what's the top speed? 110 as well. Okay, we're gonna. We're, I'm going for it. I'm gonna use that. And this is food, so that's gonna be the goods wagon HBI, because I can carry livestock and food, so we can use one train for everything. There's just how many is that? Three, I believe. Four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going to have to go for 8, and what do I call this? GB Food. Let's just hop on board with this train. This is electric, so it should be quite quiet. Look at that. Tell me that's not a good model. That is really cool. Even with the one light, and oh, that looks awesome. Should we have a ride all the way along? I think we should. Let's go first person. So we're coming up towards Edinburgh now, through the tunnel. And onto these amazing bridges. That one that dips down close to the water, then it shoots up over this valley. Oh, game freeze. And it should come into the station about now. And crosses over. Is it going to pick anything up? I doubt it, but it's worth a look. No, not at all. And the ride back. Back through this tunnel. I just want to see the journey, because I think it's also special at the southern end of this track by London. I think it looks really cool, the way it dips over the tracks, look at that. There's Inverness, or Edinburgh even, growing over the hill. Wow. And here's a sharp corner, how fast are we going, 100 miles per hour? This is quite a fast track, I put it in as fast as I could in most places, and through the tunnel. And it's going to stop here. It's got nothing to drop off or pick up, but it's still going to stop regardless. And keeps going through this tunnel, and there's going to be a level crossing through here. Uh, there it is. That's the only level crossing on this track, I believe. And nice little straight bit. Game freeze. Come on, game. Behave. Nice little straight bit, we can go full speed all the way. Come on, stop lagging, please. Over a nice little bridge here, and there, that's quite a sharp dip down there, but don't worry. And this is where it's coming into London. Ooh. And down into the tunnel, into the London depot. That was worth it. That was really cool. Oh, we got the HST. We have got the HST. Oh, we need to put that in somewhere. We must put that in. Um, let's have a look at our passenger lines. Actually, let's look at our lines in general. What's losing us money? What's making us money? 
Norwich to Plymouth has no passengers via Brighton. Eh, that might change, I hope. Uh, airport, that's Conmat, that's the one we just put in. Norwich and Brighton Fuel, not sure why they're losing us money. Uh, there's a plane, TP Inverness Rail Link. Eh. There's no major losers, what's that? I, uh, that's the bus line. Plymouth Oil making us 10 million, that is what I'm talking about. Right, where are we going to put in... So that goes to Liverpool, that goes up north. That goes, that's the longest passenger line I believe. Okay, the LNWR, how much are you making? 4 million, you're going to get some upgrades, you're going to get a HST, I hope they're not stupidly expensive. So LNWR, replacement, god please don't be expensive, please don't be expensive, please don't be expensive. HST short is... Ah, what? 43 million. Or 57 for the longer one. How long is that? Let's add it, see how long it is. 218 metres. We can accommodate it. Uh, how do I get rid of it there? How long's the short one? 150 metres. Ah, uh, I really wanted to put that on, but 60 million for one. That is not gonna happen. Not anytime soon. He guess. Let's let's have a little bit of a game. Guess how much this is gonna cost. Uh, there are three vehicles. I'm gonna guess 122 million. Ah, miles off. 40, 41 million off. God damn it! That is so expensive. Ah, uh, that would that sucks. I really wanted to put them in. Ah, uh, that is really irritating. We do need to start upgrading some passenger trains, like badly. Are you carrying anything yet? Uh, no. What about the boots? Actually, where's the train on this line? Uh, there. You carrying anything? Fifty-one. That's perfect. Fuel, we need to do something about, and we will in the next episode. So make sure you come back for that, guys. God, I love leaving you on cliffhangers. So make sure you come back for that, and I'm going to try and put the Class 43, the HST in, because that is going to be absolutely incredible. So make sure you come back for that, and I will see you then. Peace out, guys.